ओके सो वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल टुडे इज ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट ऑफ मे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू इट्स सैटरडे टुडे इन द इवनिंग आई हैव टू गो टू पुणे बट वी आर ट्राइंग टू गेट सम वर्क डन ऑन द रिक्शा सो द प्लान फॉर टुडे इज टू द प्लान इज टू टेक आउट द इंजन वी रिमूव दिस इंजन लास्ट टाइम वेन वी आर वर्किंग ऑन द प्रोजेक्ट टेक आउट द इंजन फिगर आउट द स्टफ वॉट वी वॉन्ट टू डू द कन्वर्जन स्टफ एंड ऑल एंड या वीफ पुट अ टायर ओवर यर पुट सम स्टफ टू सिट ऑन वील पुट द इंजन ओवर यर and we'll start work ये देखो शुभाई क्या क्या कर रहा है इधर इंजन खोलना है रूम में तो यू हैव टू लाइक क्लीन एंड स्टॉप आल्सो क्या दिन आ गए भाई सीईओ से लक्ष्मी भाई ये दुनिया ये मैं फिर मेरी 
Okay, so update. So today is uh, 21st July. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, it is 21st around 20th July. And the last video you saw was on 3rd June. So it's been almost more than a month, and uh, I figured out a lot of stuff has happened till then. And I did not get the time to work on the rickshaw because we, I was busy with other projects like the one year IoT, then Shark Tank, then this ERA competition, then exams, and a uh, lot of those stuff. So I got the crankshaft yesterday from the lathe shaft and he took almost 4 to 5 days. Some Jane engineering, very inefficient work. I gave him the crankshaft on Friday and it uh, he did not do anything on Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. And today Wednesday I sat uh, outside his shop from like morning 9am and I was like okay, aaj tu karke hi de bhai, mera bot time pass ho chuka hai, mein aur nahi time pass hain kar sakta and uh, or time nahi hai mere paas tu mere ko aaj hi karke de so I, wo kar liya then i took that and put a key, key slot in that so pura sab kuch kar liya uh, got the packing and all for the engine so this is the crankshaft uh, and also i got the motors from pune so <laughs> side by side bot kuch ho gaya and this is the crankshaft this is the secondary sprocket on this there will be a chain which will be connected to the motor so this is like that's the plan and uh, yeah uh, today's plan today it's it's almost evening now but uh, we don't waste time like that so today's plan is to assemble the engine hopefully and get most of the stuff done try to figure it out so this is also new for me so even i have some problems doing it but let's do it Okay, so it's around 12.30 right now, half of the engine is assembled. I'm still doubtful of why this crank is not rotating smoothly, but so this half we have assembled, there the sprocket will come. Now we just have to assemble the clutch housing and the required parameters. So hands and all are all dirty, the room is dirty basically. So the room is also dirty, got to clean it up. We'll see you guys uh, tomorrow and tomorrow we'll continue, finish the clutch. And then put the engine in the rickshaw. Hopefully, then we'll have to uh, mount some brackets over here for the motor and mount the motor. So yeah, this it will happen. It's simple, simple stuff. It's just heavy and time consuming. That's all. That's all. See you tomorrow. Okay. So by mistake, while assembling the clutch, what has happened is the crank lock, the key which was there over here on the crank. Uh, yeah, over here. <laughs> so that fell down. <laughs> now I have to open the entire engine up I guess because we need to take that key out otherwise it will mesh with some gear so it was over here this was like this and there was one key over here so that key fell down 
on that key i can't even see inside like otherwise i would have removed it directly the key is not over here nearby it can i see it so i have to again i had to again take the crank out and uh, divide the engine like basically remove it out so this is a new problem now one problem you solve there there comes another problem but that key is over here down it's stuck inside the gear so it's over there down so we have to remove it and yeah then it'll all be good So now we have the entire engine assembled so in the morning i assemble the clutch uh, the clutch and all its related things and the gear shifter uh, the gear shifter so i think maybe because i have uh, checked all the videos and whichever references that i had taken so i have references on my laptop so i was looking at the laptop references and fitting the stuff maybe maybe some error might come and we might have to go to a mechanic and he might tell us that something big has happened because you know with these things experience uh, is required to do these things and when you give it in the hands of the unexperienced something might happen so clutch and everything is assembled now gear shifter is assembled clutch is assembled everything gearbox is assembled now we'll figure out how to fit the electric motor we'll have to remove this so yeah that is the next step okay so we have removed the cylinder rods this is the motor that we bought from mechatronics trade in pune now we just have to figure out how to place this motor so that the primary and the secondary sprocket can be matched and power can be transferred from the motor to the crankshaft